remember this quest now. Yeah, because I remember after you finish it, you get access to all the different outfits. I think there's only four of them. But yeah, you get access to them all. And I remember being in Bowerstone and scaring everybody with the different outfits because, well, it was fun to do. Another one! Alright. What the hell is this? Oh my god, is that... There's a hob costume? Are you serious? Oh, great. God, this is a weird sight. A Balverine that's got a halo. I'm a good... A good Balverine. Never thought they would exist. Right, here we go. What we have to do here is growl. Can I just press it? Yeah, I can. Cool. Remember, the wisps fear living flesh. Only in the guise of a corpse. Okay, they want me to be a hollow man. Balverine brown die. Ha 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 ha. See, they never know. Will they not be able to kind of tell that I'm human under this? I mean, whatever. If they can't sense it, that's their problem, not mine. God, the weather soon changed. Yes. yes! I can feel the chains that hold me slipping away. Bring me more, I beg you. Okay. Also, the, the guy's voice that I mentioned, he was he's called voiceover man on the channel E4. Or was. I don't think he is anymore. But it's actually a guy called I think it's Peter Dixon. Something like that. Uh oh. That's like why is this not working? Yeah. I'm so glad I didn't need to hold it. Yeah! Awesome. Yeah, I think he's called Peter Dixon. It's something like that. Oh, we got some hobs. I like how they didn't even look at me, they just kind of knew something was happening. Right, there we go. Also dead. Very good. We have to go in the cave. Great. Ooh, the mysterious cave. This will be where we get the hob costume. It's also where we probably have to fight a fucking ton of hobs. What are you in Uh oh. Crap. Ugh. Oof. Bombs. Never fun. Wait, is that another statue? Wow, they missed. Good job. You suck. Okay, yeah. He also- he used to be the... the voice of E4. But if it, yeah, if he's the voice actor, uh, the voice actor, the voiceover for X Factor, yeah, I think it's the same guy. I'm pretty sure he's called Peter Dixon. Not entirely sure though. But yeah, I was surprised when I heard the voice because I was like, hmm, I recognise that, but not from games. But I don't watch X Factor, so I couldn't tell. Couldn't tell you. The last time I remember hearing his voice was E4. Ah, oh, great! I become a hob. Wearing this should give you some insight into the life of these nasty, brutish, and short creatures. Except for the fact I won't be as small as them. Ew, look at me. I'm fucking huge. I'm the fattest hob around. I mean, I now understand why this is called the costume party. I don't know if there's more to this. Or if we just have to do this one. So what the heck? Ah, uh, I can summon the kamikazes. Oh, I forgot about all this. God, puzzles. Kind of. It's actually very obvious, but still. Alright. Okay. Up. Oh. oh, fuck, really? <laughs> Help me, my spirit friend. This should be enough. Ho oh, ho. More than enough. That summons an. Ah, oh, mage! Oh man, I can get an army! Okay. Ah, okay.
I'm very confused. Oh, never mind. I think I got it. I just noticed this over here. Didn't see it before. Oh, stilts, of course. <laughs> Clearly. It was his belief that no hero would ever stoop to wearing such ridiculous outfits. And so I would be trapped here forever. Hey, who wouldn't want to be a hollow man, a ballerine, or a hob? God, could you move any slower? Easy does it. And he's on. And he died. Okay, it worked. Jeez. Yay, we drained it! Oh, point and laugh, of course. <laughs> I wanted to shoot the explosion explosive. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Destruction! Oh yeah, hollow man. How could I forget? Will this bring us out near the statue? Bloody hope so. Oh, it does indeed. That's useful. Thank you, witless mortal. Oh. You have granted me my freedom. Ah, oh, so there it is. That's all of them. The undead necromancer. Oh my god. I will grant you the greatest gift of all. Death. You look like a banshee. Oh, pardon me. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Of course he'd summon hollow men. Fuck's sake. There we go. Go! I'd probably be better off using better weapons. Fuck. Oh, very nice. Where the hell is he, though? Ah, oh, I got a shot off. It's all, work. all that matters. Oh, wait, he doesn't disappear forever. Okay. Whoa, okay. He just dashes all over the place instead. I mean, I don't really want to use skill all the time, but... It's one of my more powerful weapons, so there's that. Fuck me, he keeps dashing about the place. If I keep shooting, he'll die soon enough. Fuck. Great. Jesus. Right, I'm going to slow time again. Ouch. I can't? There we go, we got him. He didn't do much. Still got him, though. Nothing dead now? No. Fuck me. They never die. Sheesh. No, they really don't. Hmm... Right, slow time again. Hello, you. That actually hit him. Good. Look how everything's moving to me in slow-mo. Ouch. Did I even do a slow time? I don't think I did, because I got knocked on my ass instead. There we go. Ouch. Uh. Yeah, I'll just do this. Screw it. Great. Slow down time. I might. No, I won't. No, oh, I got him. There we go. Yeah! New quest available. The vision. So that means... That's the last? Uh, it might not be the last. 750. The necromancer's tricks were all in vain, and his, as his resurrection was followed swiftly by his death. The skull is cursed no more, and it will bring no misfortune upon others. Yay! Can I take off the ridiculous costumes now? I would much prefer it. Yay, I can leave. Hooray! So the next one is the vision. Alright. I'm trying to remember what the vision is. And I really don't know how many quests Murgo has. I'm assuming it's just three items. Could be five, which would be really nice, but I don't think it is. Oh. That's quite 
remarkable. Another successful exorcism. That skull will make a perfect paperweight. Lovely stuff. Well, my source has finally come through. I have in my hands the item that offers visions of the future, and it's, well, not quite what I was expecting. I was hoping for a nice crystal ball or some pretty cards. Even a bucket of entrails would have been better than this. Here, you can have it. I'll never be able to sell it to anyone else. And to tell you the truth, it gives me the willies, and not the good kind. Spire statue. Oh, great. It's a remarkable replica model of the spire. When you hold it, you feel the same unnatural hum that emanates from the real spire's walls. Best of luck with that. Fuck, really. Free. For free. Okay, I need to get rid of my freaking outfit. Yeah, I do actually have... Where would they be under, then? Hollow Man, Balverine, Hobsuit. Yeah, I thought so. Okay, what I need is... Was I using any sort of... Helmet? Oh man, look at us. Yeah. Oh, I look ridiculous with that. What about the merchant's cap? Raunchy. Oh. Ooh, look at me. Oh, here we are. I might actually keep that. <laughs> Why not? Right, so... Coats. It was the noble gents. There we are. Oh, I'm shirtless. Right, then the noble gent shirt. It's for the hands. Uh, the carriage gloves. And then no- Oh no, it was explorer's trousers. Yeah. And explorer's boots. Perfect! Oh man, look at me. Oh wait, yeah, I forgot. Masks. Uh, how can I forget? The ballroom mask. Yeah! Oh man, look at me. Oh yes. Welcome back, Goldie. What, Golden? Uh, oh, they're jobs. I was about to say, why the hell are they there? Oh no, I just saw there was like the quest marker over the blacksmith. I got very confused. Playing Fable 2! If it's a game that you've never heard of, then you are either very young or you've lived under a rock. Wait, what the hell am I looking for? Oh, there it is. Boom. Are you invisible to your boss, co-workers, and potential life mates? Then try my patented There we go. Wait, so is this actually taking us to the spire? Or is it the replica spire? This is rather weird. Whoa. What? Wait, what? Okay. That's Teresa. Here you are again. You knew you'd return here one day, did you not? Oh my god, do I have to fight Teresa? I know what your question is. Yes, the Spire had a gift for me too. The future has always whispered to me, and I have followed its sound blindly. But now I can see all possible futures. There are many threads. Too many to count. Yet there are moments when they all converge. Events that cannot be avoided. Futures which must be fulfilled. It is time I showed you one such future. Take my hand. One last time. Hmm. Okay, take a hand. Okay, maybe we don't fight her. Okay, so that was not a replica of the statue of the spire, even. Whoa, I'm a king. A king feels age weighing Ooh. him down, and the responsibility of an entire kingdom. Hell yeah! Look at me, I'm a fucking king. These oh wow! Huh. Loyal soldiers who would die for him. Many already have. On battlefields at home and in faraway lands. What they the heck? Wherever he leads. These are his people. Subjects who worship him. 
who trust him to guide them, protect them, and govern them. And this is his throne, Albion's seat of power, where he has made countless decisions, delivered justice, and led a nation. Yet none of this is of the least importance. Mm -hmm. This is Whoa. the real future. His child, not yet born, but destined for greatness. A child on whom the fate of Albion will depend one day, as will the fate of Aurora. Oh my god, is this like a big ad for Fable 3? These things you will understand in time. For now, you must live your life and prepare for what is to come. Take care, little sparrow. And remember, I am always here. Always watching. Okay, so I don't need to fight you. Cool. That was just a big hint to Fable 3. Interesting. So that, is that the end of the snow globe saga? Or well, the cursed items? I highly doubt he'll have another. I don't know why he'd make me pay for two. Give me one for free and then I have to pay for another. I get the feeling that's the end of that quest. I get the royal crown. Oh my god. It radiates power and presence, and you can almost feel the weight of history in its dense, beautiful middle. Oh, I get every... Oh, yes. I will put the royal everything on. There's the vision. You've seen what lies ahead, but it will be years before you truly understand the significance of your vision. Well played, game. Well played. So yeah, I'm assuming that was the end of all of those. Oh, wow. I am the king. Wait, the Colosseum. The future. I trust it was a favorable one. Yes. You don't want to go to all that trouble to find out you're croaking it tomorrow. <laughs> I've been doing rather splendidly for myself. All thanks to you. There's no better advertising than people see you obtaining all these rare and molecular objects. Molecular. My source? Well, I guess you know who she is now. Left one last thing for you. Something only a hero could hope to enjoy. I don't want to spoil the surprise, but have your weapon ready when you use it. Best of luck, old friend. And remember to keep shopping at Murgos. Okay. Colosseum model. Oh. The miniature model of a Colosse combat arena. Though it seems to have fat been fashioned out of some kind of clay, it emanates a strong odour of stale blood. Lovely. What I should do as well is dye my regal clothes with my regal purple. Why not? I did actually get some new ones, didn't I? Carmine, grape crop. Where is it? The regal purple. There it is. It looks more pink. Whoa. I mostly just want the cape to be coloured. It's still the noble gent shirt, so not bothered. So, the royal robe. I can't apply any dyes. Oh, of course I can't. Man, it sucks. What about the royal trousers? I can't colour any of them in. I can't dye them. That blows. Yeah, whatever. Alright, miscellaneous. And the Colosseum. Oh, hang on. There it is. Let's do this. So, it seems I was wrong. There wasn't just three items. Are those closed mods? <laughs> yeah. Uh, wait, I can see them all now. Snow globe skull, Colosseum spire. Is there one more after this? The Colosseum. Whoa. Welcome to the Colosseum, the legendary combat arena built by the Theodore Triplets. Score as many points as you can within the allotted time, earn points by killing creatures, but and build multipliers. Uh, by hitting flit switches. You can also earn bonus points by kicking chickens. You may not use potions or change inventory items during combat, so use time before and after fights wisely. Multiplier will be reset. Colosseum Teddy's guide your, guide your hand. Whoa. Whoa, okay. Also, hi, Auto Mushin. I'm probably butchering your name. How's it going? Hey, it's Voiceover Man, again. Peter Dixon voiced a shitload of stuff. I do not remember doing this. Whoa, are they like godly bugs? Good to hear it. 
I'm good, thanks. Blech. Hey, if I only have to fight bugs, I'll be quite happy. I only have Vortex on level 1. Probably should have gone with something a bit better. Oh, no. oh yeah. Yeah! Oh my god. Hero Multiplier! Ah! Oh Jesus. Now you remember, I can't use items. Fuck. I'm also like losing out on a lot of XP, but it's fine. Jesus. Keep shooting. Shoot away! Where's the flit switch? Shit. Ouch! Cool. Keep it going. It's fucking assassins. You suck. Yeah, screw you! Enjoy the vortex. I say I'm probably losing half of my magic, but it's fine. Uh, not magic, experience. Eh, don't really matter. Blah. Oh dear. Kick the chicken bonus. Okay. I'll kick the chicken. We got it. <laughs> oh my god. This is a mistake, but I'm gonna do it anyway. There we go. Oh my. I thought that would have done more. Ooh. Hold up, hold up. Can I hit it with level 5? I can't. Fuck. I don't want to miss it though. No, you fuck. <laughs> You're blocking my flit switch. You're still blocking the flit switch. Oh my god, this sucks. I can't hit it. Oh dear. Yeah, I can't hit it because of bullshit. There we go. Christ. Well, the Colosseum is a lot more chaotic than I thought it would be. Wait. Level 3. Okay. Ugh. Deary me. Why the sad face? Oh. I didn't see the don't, don't die. Oh my god, XP. Hell yeah. Hey, even if I get only the third place, I'll be quite happy. It means not much to me. Where's the flit switch? Ah, where is the flit switch? Flit switch, flit switch. I have to... Fuck. Ugh. We got it. Nice. I do like how this insta-kills. Boom! Kaboom! Kill the Balverine. I want that Balverine gone. They just kind of explode into nothingness. That's a big hub. Jeez. You killed him! I like how they just disappear. Kick the chicken. Fucking hell. Wait, did the chicken disappear? Oh man. It's not the chicken. Oh, I see how this works now. I don't know why I didn't realise, but I thought it was just... You have to clear the room in five minutes. It's actually, you have five minutes to score as much as you can. Which I now realise. I should constantly have this up too, because it actually slows down time, which is super nice. Oh, I didn't get... Oh no, I did. I did, I did. Oh wait, kick, kick the chicken. I don't know what the flit switch was. Oh, there. I don't think I can hit it. Fuck okay. it. Speed up. We got it! Yeah, I really want time to be slowed down. Just so then I have more time. Technically. There we go. Whoa. Oh, Banshee. Great. This isn't a pain in the ass at all. Not at all. Ooh, damn. Come on, come on, come on. There, 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 there. Wizard Teddy? What the fuck? What's this for? This cuddly, cuddly bear represents the most talented of the three founding brothers of the Colosseum, Alvin Theodore, who is an accomplished magic user and perhaps the two numbers sewn into his wizard's hat are part of some numer numerical spell. They are one 
a one and a nine. Okay. You have found one of the three Theodore bears. Can you find the other two? Probably. Alright, we got the Banshee. Fuck. Crap, crap, crap. Ah! I thought I saw a, a thing. Maybe I didn't. <laughs> I'm just gonna use that again. I wasted time. I think I've done it. 15,000 was the top prize, and I think I've done it. Not bad. Hey! Smashed it! Well, not quite smashed it, but yeah, whatever. Oh no. God, look at all the XP just flying away into the air. Jesus. Kick the chicken! Ay -ay 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 -ay. Jesus. I want to kick the chicken. I also just want to do this. I love using level 5 spells. They're just so satisfying. Chicken kicked. Holy experience. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus. Fuck me. Ah, leave me alone. Oh my Christ. Fuck. Ah. Oh. Oh, it reset everything to Vortex. You suck. Level 5 Vortex. Just to end things off. Woo! Well, I did it. Yeah! I am a winner. So, score, henchman score, 23, or 22,000. Hero creature kills. Not bad. So what's this? Number of completed Colosseum games. Total gold earned. Wait, the higher the score means the mul- uh, the, the what is it? I don't know what I'm trying to say. What your, your score represents the amount of money you earn. Hmm. Okay. That's what I said, did I only get third? What? First prize! Troll strength potion. Not needed, sadly. Ultimate, <laughs> Ultimate! Whoa! It's worse than my cleaver, but I get a royal scepter. Though its primary primary purpose is an as an ornamental staff, denoting its wield of royalty, it serves just as well as a clobbering instrument. After all, kings and queens are notorious for their love of splitting skulls. It's worse than the cleaver. That's a shame. Yeah, I don't. I, I want to leave. I don't want to do this again. That's a really cool place, though. I don't remember doing that ever. Wow. Huh. Not too shabby. Yeah, it was pretty fun. <laughs> I was really worried when it got like halfway through and I was only at... I don't even know how much I was in. I maybe had 5,000 or so. I was like, there's no way. But what do you know? We're actually done with his quests. Hooray! Good stuff. So the only thing I have left is... Well, I can do the Colosseum as many times as I wish. Not whole tower... Uh, tower. Not whole islands, Big Freeze is the only one I have left. Yay! That I've not already done. Although I do want to see, how bad is the scepter? Like, is it really that? I keep going on the wrong thing. Weapons. Melee. How is that worse? Oh, it's probably because it's slow. Speed, slow. Type, blunt. I mean, it's slow, but it's better. I want it. I'm using it. I don't care. Right, so how many augments do I have? I really hope I have some good ones and not just ones that suck. I have six. Gold, burden, discipline, discipline, lucky charm, golden touch. They're all crap. What's bewitching do? Make you more attractive? No. Gain. So what's this? Gets you gold for every kill. Earns more experience. Dish out more damage and take less yourself. That's quite good. Yeah. I really don't think I have all that good ones. No. That still only does 90. I thought it would do more. Alright, cool. Right, do not haul island. Look at this weapon. God, I really am like royalty now. In my royal robes, with my royal scepter, and a blunderbuss that will blow you to hell. Good shit. Alright, not haul island. Let's go. I really hope I can. I am the true king. I'm just a common citizen person, uh, the kind you see every day around these parts. Sure you are, Gordon. Wait, you're one of them, aren't you? 
an adventuring hero fighter thingy. Oh, good. The chieftain made me memorise a speech. Let's see. My name is Gordon. I come from Not Whole Island, which <laughs> is in dire need of your help. We come from Not Whole Richard Island. Has gripped our land, and only someone valiant enough to recover the mystical summer stone can save us. I impassionately <laughs> plead that you aid us in our time of need. All right, Gordon. Not bad, eh? <laughs> I bought some gifts from the island too, if that helps to convince you. Ooh. Will you come then? Give me these gifts. I have to accept first. Why are people following me? If you're worried about my submarine, I can tell you it's almost perfectly safe. I invented it myself. Isn't that reassuring? I never actually thought about that. That's a relief. It could be. You mean from the lost chapters? Mm. I hope my submarine can hold two people. And a dog. One burnt calorie potion. Oh yeah, not whole island's got some really weird things. You probably lose more weight if you breathe in hard. Yeah, it actually could be, but I am not sure. When God and the Not Hoglade inventor decided he would one day fly into the heart of the sun, he reasoned he would need some sort of protection against the glare. Uh, though these glasses were never put to their intended use, they proved useful to players of the popular Guess What My Eye <laughs> What Colour My Eyes Are game. I'll use those. Not Whole Island Volume 1, so I have a book. Holy crap, Assassin's Gloves. Not Whole Knight's Boots. Fuck me. I'm not wearing the mask anymore, I'm just wearing some shades. Awesome. Not Hull Island. I impassionately... I don't recognise this from Lost Chapters. Although... I'll be honest, I haven't really played Lost Chapters all that much, so you could be right. 